poppin' YouTube. I'm back with a shoe review. I told you I was gonna come back with something, so I'm gonna start with one right here. What I got? Foam posits, cough drops, black and red. Yeah, 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 yeah. Start with, start with this one. Okay. Has a clear red icy sole. It's so sexy. The top. Back tab, painted hardaway sign, mesh here. I like the way it feels. Like this is a very comfortable shoe. Another tab here. The red lining going throughout the shoe, as you can see. Then a uh, penny hardaway sign right there. On the bottom of the shoe, I wear them. You know, I can clean them. You know, it's not that bad. Another penny hardaway sign. Carbon fiber, carbon fiber, carbon fiber right here. Carbon fiber right here. As you can tell, these are real. Because dudes that rock the fake ones are like checker white and black. And that's not how they're supposed to look. They're supposed to be dark and gray. I'm not sure if you can really see it like that. But, you know, they're supposed to be like, you know, dark and gray. Not like white and black. Like, yeah, it's fake. So, you know... These came out June 19th, 2010 at the House of Hoops, so they're fairly new. They're a tough shoe. They retail for, what, it was $200, $199.99, and with tax, it was $212. So a very expensive shoe. You know, you got the coppers, the eggplants, the royal blues, the pearls, and then you got the upcoming electric green pros, the royal blues re-releasing, and the pewters coming out. I'm copying all three of those. I don't care. How much they cost? They're probably gonna be 200 each, but I'm copying all of them. So like, you know, see, very nice shoe, comfortable shoe and everything. Great shoe. So, they, I heard these are coming back out December 23rd. They're re-releasing again with the um, Cool Gray 11s that come out the 23rd, which I will be getting those too. So, um, yeah, cough drops. I'm out.